The idea of a St. Bernard Husky mix sounds pretty adorable when you consider the look of the parent dogs. There is the big, cuddly St. Bernard and the beautiful Husky, with those piercing eyes. Online pictures of St. Bernard Husky mixed dogs show that there are indeed some cute pups in these mixed litters, but what about their health and personalities? In this video we will look at what to expect from the St. Bernard Husky mix. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique guide is in the description below. How big does a Husky St. Bernard mix get? It is important to consider the size of this St. Bernard Husky mix. We have a large parent breed in the St. Bernard and a smaller, medium-sized parent in the Husky. This means that new owners should expect their pups to reach a size somewhere in the middle. This will vary depending on which parent that they most take after and their gender. This means a weight of anywhere between 60 to 120 pounds and a height of around 25 to 30. Therefore, you could have a dog that acts like a husky, but with a lot of extra weight to throw around. This means that there are some issues to consider. The first is the importance of a good exercise regimen. The problem here is that you now have the high energy of the husky plus the extra weight of the saint. This means the need for a good diet and exercise regimen. They will need a lot of exercise, with long walks in the park, and will benefit from a large yard to play in. On the subject of play, it can also help to use some interactive dog toys and the brain training for dogs during playtime. This is great to aid with the bonding process for a good relationship and better socialization. Then there is the problem of socialization. An issue with the St. Bernard is that it can be a little sensitive and unaware of size. Meanwhile, the Husky is not good with children. Therefore, they will need some strong socialization training from an early age, and aren't well suited to families. Other behavioral issues to consider here are problems with boundaries, a possible prey drive and mouthiness. These hybrid dogs are smart animals that can pick up commands well. But, there are stubborn, independent streaks in both parents that could make housebreaking and leash training more difficult. Finally, new owners of this Husky St. Bernard Cross need to consider their grooming needs. Both parent breeds experience moderate shedding, which means regular brushing and vacuuming with their offspring. A Furminator might help with that thick dense coat during the worst shedding seasons. This coats means a high tolerance for cold climates but some issues in hot climates. The colors of this coat will vary. Some are pale like a Husky, while some have the reds of Saint. Bernard and even their markings around the face. Looking for a St. Bernard Husky mix for sale or adoption. The first option here is to find breeders with St. Bernard Husky mix puppies for sale. There will be many people that specialize in this cross, taking the time to raise healthy, happy litters with the best traits. Make sure to find the breeder with the experience and appreciation of the parent dogs and breeding needs. Where possible, meet the pups and parents before buying. Also be careful with the St. Bernard Husky Mix Puppies price tag. Some breeders may try and charge more if they are the only breeder in the area, or if they have desirable coat colors and pups with blue eyes. Others will charge too little, which is the sign of an irresponsible breeder that may not put the health of their dogs first. Is this Husky and St. Bernard cross a good idea? Whether you get a full-grown St. Bernard Husky mix or a puppy, there are some important traits to keep in mind. There are potential problems with their energy levels, training and health care. However, those that are trained early by couples not young families should do well. Patience and experience will create a great St. Bernard Husky mix temperament. This beautiful St. Bernard Husky mix will do well in the right home. Just make sure that you can provide it before buying one. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. 
Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.